Good evening. This is Front Page by AIM Network. India's semiconductor story has hit another crucial and significant milestone. So have you ever wondered why EVs, cars or industrial machines become expensive or delayed? This is one of the chips that quietly decides that. And this milestone is where it truly matters. Power electronics and automotive semiconductors. Japan's ROHM, one of the world's most respected semiconductor companies, whose power chips quietly run factories, energy systems and a lot more across the world, has signed a strategic manufacturing partnership with Tata Electronics to assemble and test automotive grade chips in India. So if you've been following front page, which I'm sure you have been, we've covered this tectonic semiconductor shift when Tata announced its $14 billion fab and Intel partnership. This ROHM deal is the next big layer on top of that strategy. So well, first is phase one, which is very sharply defined, which is Tata will assemble and test ROHM's India-designed 100V, 300A automotive grade silicon MOSFET in toll package with mass production targeted by next year. Power semiconductors are not your everyday chips. This is the kind of chip that decides how efficiently an EV converts battery power into motion and how much heat it wastes doing it. They actually control electric vehicles, automotive powertrains, industrial machines, energy systems, AI era power infrastructure. So without power semiconductors, nothing really moves, nothing accelerates and nothing scales. This partnership does three big things, moves India deeper into automotive semiconductor manufacturing, accelerates domestic value addition, strengthens a trusted, resilient global supply chain. So why does this matter? And so much. Because building fabs without power and automotive chips is like building, well, highways without engines. And this locks directly into India's broader semiconductor strategy. Tata's $11 billion fab in Dhulera, Gujarat. Tata's $3 billion OSAT facility in Assam. Tata's expanding packaging ecosystems, India's push to build the entire semiconductor value chain and Tata's recently announced collaboration to manufacture and package Intel chips in India. So now if we add ROHM to that equation, India now has then global chip design, global chip partners, manufacturing capacity, packaging infrastructure and finally fabulous credibility. The partnership roadmap includes mass production by next year, co-developing advanced chip packaging technologies, expanding semiconductor product lines from India, serving both Indian and international markets. So if executed well, this creates high-skill semiconductor jobs, a talent flywheel, a, a maturing semiconductor ecosystem across Gujarat and Assam. And most importantly, India shifts from chip dependent to chip producing to chip exporting. And in, in conclusion, here is the front page take. The Tata ROHM partnership means this. It is a hard manufacturing commitment. It anchors India deeper into automotive and power semiconductor supply chains. It actually signals global trust, serious execution and long-term strategy. With Tata building fabs, OSAT facilities, Intel manufacturing partnerships and now ROHM automotive chips, India's semiconductor ambition no longer looks like a dream. It actually finally has started to look like a magnificent plan with factories, timelines and deployment. And of course, the world is beginning to take notice. Ladies and gentlemen, this is Front Page by AIM Network. Like, share, subscribe, and always remember, think AI, think AIM.